president of the ANC went to a meeting with Solidarity. They raised this issue of the need to relook affirmative action, including the sunset clause. He didn't say it shall not be done. He said it's a very interesting idea, one that we're going to look at. What did Jimmy Manyi say? Nothing. So I'm saying it's very important that we're very clear. Remember, I was talking about leadership must be confident, must be able to answer. So I'm telling you to be able to say to them, no, no, no. Don't try to fob us off. We know there are few people who have benefited in terms of this BEE. We want more people to benefit. You want few to benefit? Defend that. We're going to defend the broader masses because we want a broad-based black economic empowerment. Of course we want affirmative action. In the public sector, things are looking a little bit much better. But in the private sector, the picture is not that rosy. So we need to be able to say, yes, we need it. But at the same time as we do that, we are correct to be able to say, we must ensure that affirmative action benefit the people it's intended for and not simply be used for cronyism, jobs for pals. No, sasa kone school, sasa funa kabanda ba mnyam, akfuna kabanda ba mnyam, akfuna lo mnyam, lo mfuna yowe. Can't work on that particular basis. We must be able to be clear on those issues. Then there is a distinct matter of but there are poor South Africans who are white, who are black, who live in informal settlement, who don't have water, who don't have quality education. You have to treat all of them the same because the litmus test is that these people are poor.